Hello, my warriors. Welcome to Let's Talk About It Thursday. Topic. What if your man thing thing is just right? But he's a minute man. What should you do? I ask people to leave a topic. This person left a topic. And we're going to talk about it. (laughs) Well, first of all, if it's just right, that's the good part. Okay? Then second, he's a minute man. Hmm. So, ooh. Ooh. I'm about to break my nail. Let's talk about it. If he's a minute man, meaning that as soon as he get in, you know, the muscles of your wall is squeezing and squeezing and squeezing that banana to the point where he cannot hold out. Okay. So, step one. First of all, he needs to involve a good amount of foreplay. Okay? And I'm not just talking about kissing. Bro, man, is going to have to go down there. And he going to have to wet it. Okay? And one way... Is, you know, a lot of guys like it to be up in the air. The boom boom. So, he gonna have to wet it up in the air. If you get my drift. And I feel that if he wets it to the point where he help her climax. Then... When it's time for him to go in and do his little jiggy jiggy that's going to last for one minute, then at least she'll be on God where she's trying to go. Now, there are some women who don't mind, you know, the foreplay first, them coming first, but they may still want more than that one minute of jiggy jiggy okay so what he's gonna have to do is find a way to get back on hard okay now i'ma say i have seen different movies but normally they can last a long time but I'm going to say the movies may be on TV where, you know, they don't show that much. But he only lasted for a little while. Sometimes what those women do is they clean it up and then they give him a little wet moisturizer wash. Okay. Trying to keep it. Okay. And when they do that, they get him back on hard to the point where they can go what they call round two. So, it just really depends on, is he a man that can get back on hard, okay? Now, let's go back to what I think she's talking about. Let's say... The man, when that minute is up, he's up. Okay? (laughs) Then it's going to be a huge problem. So what he's going to have to do is he's going to have to get her off first. He's going to have to. If he don't and make that minute really count, there's going to be a problem. Because she's going to get the urge 
to want to continue and then what may happen is she may end up going to someone else that can go a nice amount of time now I used to hear back in the day oh if he comes home and y'all make love and he climbs that fast that means he ain't been doing nothing. Or if he took a long time, then that means he's been doing something. So that's not all true. People say that, but that's not all true. You should know your man. I mean, because normally when two people get together, even if the man still has somebody on the side, he is going to show that woman he's trying to get with the world. Okay, so he's going to try to, you know, show him he got skills. Okay. So, like I said, it just depends on if he's one of those minute persons to the point where once that minute is up, it's a done deal. That's when we might have a problem. A lot of men need to learn how to, and I guess this is mostly for men to hear, a lot of men need to learn how to hold out. I mean, okay, yes, she feels good, it's good down there, whatever the case may be. He has to hold out. He got to, you know... You know, like, for instance, when, I know this sounds bad. It's a little TMI. But let's say you got to go to the bathroom and you holding that booty tight. That's what men have to do. They have to hold their banana tight. Hold it in there. Don't let it out. You know? And I would say, you know, when he feel he about to pull out, but then it can intertwine with <clears throat> the woman trying to reach her destiny. And trust me, it is sometimes hard for a woman to get right where she's trying to go, and then he move. Man, it's to the point where you want to take your fist and you want to get him an uppercut. Okay. Yo, excuse that mess in the back. Not really mess. My boxes. But yeah. You got to work together as a couple. If you're a man and you know that you cutting your woman short, then you need to um Find ways to make it good. You got to you gotta get her off first. And once you get her off, then you, you know, going to get your jiggy jiggy on. Because if you, if y'all doing the 69 position, you going to, you going to release before you even get in there. I already know that. That's what's going to happen. Because if you're a minute man. So, the key thing here is pretty much just working together and trying to get to the point where um, you can please each other. And mostly, it is the woman who can please the man. It's just the man who's having trouble pleasing the woman. But then that's when you need to talk to a doctor or something and see if there's something they can prescribe to you, for you however you want to call it a lot of people use that Viagra and they say the Viagra it, it makes you stay hard longer and they have other things out there that does the same so sometimes you have to figure out what's best but you gotta make sure if you have any health problems, you need to be careful. Because 
you do not want to take some medicine or I wouldn't say medicine. Well, you're already taking medicine, right? But you're adding, they will call it drugs. That's what they're going to call it. You adding drugs to the situation because that's what they're going to call it, okay? So, I'm hoping that this person who asked the question, I helped in some kind of way. So, again, if your man think thing is just right and he's a minute man, then you and him need to work on that. Because if it's just right, that's what you want to be. You want to be right there, okay? <laughs> so if you enjoyed this video, give it a big thumbs up. If you're not a warrior yet, what are you waiting on? Go ahead and hit the subscribe button to hit the notification button to be notified of all videos along with share this video. Let them know what your girl is doing. Thanks for watching. Later.